Hey guys, it's Haley, and today I'm going to be doing two videos in one. One of them is going to be a fall makeup look idea, and my second is going to be some of my fall essentials. If you guys like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up, and you guys click the subscribe button down below. I think it's over here. It's probably over there. I don't know if I'm... I'm I'm gonna watch this video and see if I'm right or not, but you guys know where it is. So if you wanna subscribe, you guys can click the subscribe button. Also, if you guys have any fall series ideas, like name ideas, because I n don't normally like name my series, but I really wanted to do that this year. So you guys, if you guys have any fall series name request ideas, leave them in the comments below as well. And if you have any more video requests in general, then you guys can also leave those in the comments. But without further ado, let's hop into this video. Okay, so for the makeup, I'm starting off with just a clear, regular face, no makeup, and I'm adding my primer, my eye primer, which really, like, whenever I first put it on, it looks really weird and, like, like I messed up, but it's all good. And then I'm taking my Naked 2 palette, and in just my, like, my regular flat kind of brush, I'm taking the color Foxy, which is just kind of, like, my base color. Obviously, I apply this to both my eyes. I don't show both my eyes, I just show one eye, but I am applying it to both. And then I'm taking the color Chopper. I don't know if you guys could see that, but... That's what I'm taking, and I'm putting that on both eyes, and then I'm taking Snake Bite with my little blending brush, and obviously just putting that in, like, my lid, my, the crease of my lid, I don't really know what's that, like, what that's called, but yeah, you guys can see where I'm blending it, and I do that with both eyes, both eyes, obviously, and then I'm taking my Naked to, like, brush and just blending that out, and then I'm going to Half Baked, in the Naked palette and just applying that, like tapping it on my lid. And I'm obviously doing that to both of my eyes. And then that is how it looks. And then I'm taking my eyelash curler. I'm just curling my eyelashes, both my eyes, with my eyelash curler. And then I'm taking my CoverGirl mascara and just applying that, obviously, to both my eyes as well. I don't apply it to my bottom lashes just because I don't really like it on my bottom lashes. Then I take my 24-hour brown eyeliner and apply that to both eyes. Uh, uh, both of my eyes on my waterline and then I'm taking some white tannish eyeshadow and applying that to my crease and then I'm taking some darker lip gloss and applying that to my lips and that is the finished fall makeup look ta-da okay so starting with my first fall essential um I one of my like biggest like I don't know I just always feel like I have to do this for fall so I don't really change the wallpaper on my phone but I do change it on like my computer or my like iPad I don't use my computer that much and I use my iPad a ton so I change my wallpaper so like wallpaper in here says hello September and it's like fall leaves and I thought it was really cute but, okay so for my second essential um I this is like a big essential obviously candles um this one is actually a candle but this is like a little cinnamon sugar donut one it doesn't really have anything to do with fall it smells it's like it's, it smells like fall like it smells like leaves more than it smells like donut. My next thing is obviously, I'm pretty sure all of you guys know exactly what these are. Melty things, you put these cubes, you like break the cubes, and then you put them into like a little candle melting pot thing, I don't know what it's called, and it melts it in and it makes your house smell really good. This is the Glycerin Bayberry Garland, and it kind of smells like Christmas, but it smells like fall at the same time. Something else that is a big essential for fall that I love to do all the time are just adding pillows to my bed. I think this is upside down. No, it's not. Okay. Adding pillows to my bed, especially like fall color ones, like maroon or brown or green. You guys know like the fall colors. This is the one I love for my bed. I love having this one for fall just because like, it's not really fall colors, but I don't know. It's really cute. And I just like these tiny pillows that go on my bed. I just think it makes my room look super cute because it makes my room a lot more cozy. My next essential is obviously the obvious. Everyone probably loves this in the fall time, but our oh, oh, my sweatshirt's backwards, but our sweatshirts and they are so comfortable. Because, well, just have a lazy day because everyone like needs to have a lazy day once in a while. Um, sorry, that was bothering me. But everyone needs to have a lazy day and these are perfect. Embrace the sweatshirt, okay? I love sweatshirts and I cannot wait to wear this. I think I might put this on after this video, but I want it to look somewhat decent for this video. One of my essentials for fall is obviously leggings. I'm obsessed with wearing athletic leggings because then like you can just wear it with your sweatshirt. Obviously you can wear cotton ones too. I have a gray pair with Under Armour and then like these are just black Nike ones, but I've been loving leggings. My next thing is obviously this is my favorite thing and I love to do this in fall because I feel like any color you put with matte in fall is just like 
I just have this big matte top coat by Sal. I just love this. Like, if you have, like, brown nail polish and then you, like, get a matte, it's bam, fall nails. My next fall essential, which this is, like, an, this is an obvious one. Like, this is, like, really obvious. But obviously hand sanitizers because I need hand sanitizers for every season. I have hand sanitizers for every season. I absolutely love these hand sanitizers. So, yeah, but they're just all fall theme. You can go to Bath and Body Works and get 5 for 5, which is the best deal in the world. My next and my last favorite for fall, or essential for fall, I guess, is having a really glittery, maroony, brownish, dark eyeshadow. I don't know, like just fall color eyeshadows. And this is like the Naked 2 palette. I obviously use it a lot, but I'm starting to use a lot of the other colors in here. Fally colors, I don't really know, but I love this for fall and I'm starting to like experiment new eyeshadow looks for fall time. But yeah, I really like this and also my makeup look that I showed you guys had these little thingy in my barbers. Alright so that was it for this video. I hope you guys liked this video. If you did make sure to give it a thumbs up and again click the subscribe button if you want to. Obviously if you have any requests leave them in the comments below along with a fall series name idea because I don't know what to call my fall series. See you guys next time. Bye!